Hello everyone, uh, here is a brief update on the latest news on the government's measures to control the pandemic and especially on their application for our town. During the last few weeks, people from Gaspé did great efforts to reduce the number of cases before the holidays. And we had succeeded. As of today, only nine active cases remain on the Côte de Gaspé area. So, I understand and agree with the disappointment of many people, organizations, organizations and the businesses uh, to see our region fall into the red zone from today till January, January 11. We cannot change this decision of the government and public health. We have to live with it. And beyond the statistics, they had reasons to take this decision and we will have to comply. So again, we have to give a great collective effort and I give ourselves a challenge. Respect the rules, avoid contamination and we could fall, fall back uh, into the orange or yellow zone on, on uh, January 11. I do not want to repeat all the rules you already know. Avoid any physical gatherings uh, with a little exception for single people. And washing, uh, and washing, wear, wear a mask, etc. You know all this. I want to focus on the application of the new rules versus the municipal services. Following the advice of the authorities, here are our conclusions. So the arenas will be able to open only for skating, not for hockey. A maximum of 25 people inside, distance of two meters, and wear the mask compulsory indoors. We do not invent the rules, we just enforce them. The schedules will be released shortly and uh, you will need to reserve your place through the town's website. Our 11 outdoor skating rinks will be able to open, maximum eight people at a time. They are administrated by uh, volunteers committees and uh, I ask you to be respectful towards them they must apply the rules imposed on us. If the committees open, open their chalet, ends disinfection, two meters distance, and where the mask will be compulsory. As for the trails and the ski centers, Bechervais, uh, Forillon, Les Eclairs, Montpessac, uh, Appalachian Trail, etc., here too, these are committees that manage these sites. When the slopes are ready, you can go skiing or snowshoeing uh, by following the rules, the distance, etc. The committees will tell you the procedures to access the, ch the chalet if applicable. As soon as the bay will, uh, is frozen enough, ice, ice fishing will be allowed. One person or one address per cabin and no outdoor gatherings either. Permits will be avail available from January, January 4 by calling or emailing Urbanism Department. If the ice is okay, you can settle in before January 4 and get your municipal permit during the week of January 4. For the Pavillon des Sports at the CEGEP, we refer you to the collegiate, uh, collegiate authorities. Uh, our libraries will be closed as community centers, performance hall, etc. Office workers should be teleworking as much as possible so town, the town hall will be closed to the public until January 11. For other openings or closings, businesses, schools, etc., this is the responsibility of the Quebec government, so I refer you to public health and to the government website. As since the start of the pandemic, we rely on the expertise of public health and we apply the rules. You don't have to agree with them, but we ask you to apply them anyway if we want to, to end up getting out of this situation and if we want to be respectful of our entourage, our elders and the most vulnerable people. In closing, I remind you of our collective challenge. We have to cross this, this temporary red zone while respecting the rules if we want to fall back into the orange or the yellow zone from January 11. So use the phone, use FaceTime or anything like that for your dinner and your party with your loved ones. 
and let's give another big collective effort and we'll be fine. Thank you everyone and happy holidays.